It's time for State Farm's presentation of BCQ, the Black College Quiz. Let's meet today's contestants. What's up, everybody? My name is Chase Lavalis, a sophomore chemical engineering student from the illustrious university known as Prairie View a and I would like to give a shout out to all my professors and all my friends, not only in Prairie View, but anywhere else around the world. Peace! Hi, my name is Tiara Anderson. I'm from Chicago, Illinois. I attend Philander Smith College, where I'm a sophomore English major. I'd like to give a shout out to my sisters and my brother, and I'd like to also give a shout out to Sky and Star. One day, this will be you. And now, here's your host, Nephew Tommy. What's up, everybody? Welcome to Black College Quiz, the game show where students from our nation's HBCUs compete to win prizes, scholarship money by showing what they know about history, entertainment, politics, and much, much more. This competition consists of four rounds. We're starting the first round of competition today with what we call the Talented 24. 24 students battling it out, ultimately claiming bragging rights as the BCQ champion. We've already met today's contestants. Y'all ready? Yes, sir. Huh? Woo! Are you ready? Yes, sir. Chase, you ready? Yes, sir. Tier? I'm ready. All right, ready? High, high five. Can I get a high five? Here go. There it is. All right. This is the multiple choice round. Here we go. Which movie was inspired by the story about a butler who served eight American presidents over three decades? Tier? Lee Daniels, the butler. Lee Daniels, the butler. Thank you. Dre Johnson struggles to instill a sense of cultural identity in his kids while living in a white community in what sitcom? Chase. Blackish. Blackish. Who signed with the Cleveland Indians in 1947 and was the first player to go directly from Negro League to the majors? Chase. Larry Doby. Larry Doby, that's correct. Name the first African-American auto dealer to be awarded an Oldsmobile and Cadillac franchise from General Motors. Chase. Albert Johnson. Albert Johnson, correct. This civil rights era photographer was the first black journalist to win the Pulitzer Prize for journalism. Tierra. Moneta J. Sleep Jr. That is correct. What 1954 Supreme Court decision overturned the Plessy versus Ferguson decision of 1896? Tierra. Brown versus the Board of Education, Topeka, Kansas. That is absolutely correct. <laughs> Thurgood Marshall said, our whole constitutional heritage rebels as the thought of giving government the power to blank. Chase. Control men's minds. Control men's minds. Name Charles Chestnut's first novel examining interracial relationships, racial identity, and passing in post-Civil War U.S. Tierra. Is it Iola Leroy? That is incorrect. The House Behind the Cedars. The House Behind the Cedars, that is correct. <laughs> Name the psychologist who founded the Northside Center for Child Development and Harlem Youth Opportunities Unlimited. Chase. Kenneth Bancroft Clark. Kenneth Bancroft Clark, that's correct. This HBCU was started with $500 raised by nine freed slaves who are known now as the Marion Nine. Tierra. Alabama State University? That is correct. All right. All right, all right. That's the end of the first round. How y'all feeling? Good. Feeling good. Feeling good? All right, Chase, you're sitting on 450 points right now, my man. 450. <laughs> Tierra, you got 300 points. You're not far behind. The rapid fire round is up next. Stay tuned. This is BCQ. Stay in the know with everything BCQ. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at BLK College Quiz. Then make sure you like us on Facebook at Black College Quiz. Join the conversation everywhere by using the hashtag Black College Quiz. This presentation of Black College Quiz is brought to you by State Farm. Find your agent at statefarm.com and in part by McDonald's, deeply rooted in the community 365 days a year. Walmart, low prices every day on everything at Walmart. And Swiffer, give cleaning a new meaning. Hello, here at State Farm, we believe all students deserve access to a quality education to help them achieve their greatest potential, help them become good community citizens, and prepare them for the workforce. 
We're grateful for programs like the Black College Quiz that help make this possible. On behalf of State Farm, the title sponsor of the Black College Quiz, thank you for watching and stay tuned for today's winner. What I would like to do when I graduate from college is with my chemical engineering degree and work in the alternative energy field. Well, my, my parents are State Department, work at State Farm, so I'm a State Department kid, so I've gotten to live in five different countries in my, so far in my life. So I've been able to do things as, such as live with the Maasai Mara tribe for a week in Nairobi, Kenya, to graduate in front of the pyramids while I lived in Cairo. So, you know, you get, when all those places you get to go to, you know, you get to see really cool things and really great experiences that you wouldn't get otherwise. Welcome back to BCQ, the game show that educates our minds and supports HBCUs. So let's keep the battle going with some rapid fire. First up is my man Chase. What's up, sir? Straight up out of Prairie View. Yes, sir. TV! You know! Okay, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Hey, man, so what you majoring in the Prairie View? Uh, chemical engineering, sir. Okay, okay. Now, they tell me you are, you're a world traveler? Yes, sir. My parents worked for the State Department, so I've lived overseas for 13 years. Okay, okay. So tell me, where, where have you been? Uh, I've been in Munich, Cairo, Manila, and Nairobi, Kenya. Yeah, yeah I don't know where none of that's <laughs> Yeah, where's, where's, where's uh, the first one? Min the first one, Munich. I was, born, I was born in Virginia, moved to Munich from Munich. Well, just slow down. Where's oh, Munich? Munich, Germany. Oh, okay, Germany. That's in Germany. Yes, All right, sir. now we're working something. Yeah, we're working. I, okay, I, I now what's you. after Munich? After Munich is Manila, Philippines. Philippines. Yes, sir. Yes. Sexy. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're going to leave it at that. Yes, sir. You ready to play some rapid fire? Yes, sir. You sure? Yes, sir. All right, you know how this goes, man. You got about 60 seconds. You got seven questions. Yes, sir. All right. If you want to pass, you can pass, and we'll come back to it if we got time, all right? Yes, sir. All right. Get ready, get ready. Start the clock. True or false, Alonzo Mourning returned to play after having a kidney transplant. True. Clyde Drexler was a member of the Dream Team or NBA Coach of the Year. Dream Team. Who was widely considered the first player to, re to reflect the hip-hop generation? Allen Iverson. True or false, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar played with both the Los Angeles Lakers and Atlanta Hawks. False. Was Paul George or Willis Reed, known for the injury walkout, walkout in 1970 NBA Finals? Willis Reed. What 1973 New York Knicks champion was nicknamed the Pearl? Earl the Pearl, uh, Earl the Pearl Robinson. He is one of the highest paid coaches currently with the Los Angeles Clippers. Doc Rivers. There we go, we got them all in. We got them all in, we got them all in. Yes, all right, please, please. You know. All right, you go that way. Yes, sir. I'll talk to you in a minute, all right? And coming out is the beautiful Tiara. How you doing, though? Okay, how are you today? I'm good, I'm good. Welcome, welcome. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, okay. Tell me about your school. T say the name of it for me. Philander Smith College. Philander Smith, say it one time. Philander Smith College. Philander, you say it so fast. <laughs> All right. What'd you major in? English. English. Yes. Okay, tell me something about you that nobody knows. Uh, mm. That's a lot of stuff. Everybody know everything about you? <laughs> I don't know. Everybody loves me. Everybody loves you? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And what year are you in? I'm a sophomore. Sophomore? Yeah. Okay. And what's the first thing we're going to do when we graduate? I'm um, going to grad school. Oh, we're going back to school. Oh, right back. Right back. Yeah, ain't okay. no breaks. Okay. You just, just spend all your mama money out. <laughs> no, scholarships. Scholarships. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. You ready? We're going to play some rapid fire. Okay. I'm ready. All right. Here we go now. You got 60 seconds. We got seven questions. If you want to pass, you can pass and we'll come back and do it if we got time. Okay. All right. Here we go. Start the clock. True or false? Alonzo Mourning returned to play after having a kidney transplant. True. Clyde Drexler was a member of the Dream Team or NBA Coach of the Year. True. Who was widely considered the first player to reflect hip-hop generation? Rakim. True or false? Kareem Abdul-Jabbar played for both the Los Angeles Lakers and Atlanta Hawks. False. Was Paul George or Willis Reed known for the injury walkout in the 1970 NBA Finals? Paul George or who? Or oh, Willis Reed. Willis Reed. What 1973 New York Knicks champion was nicknamed the Pearl? Earl, the Pearl Monroe? He is one of the highest paid coaches currently with the Los Angeles Clippers. Doc Rivers. Got them all in, baby. Got them all in. All right, stay right here. We're gonna see how you did. Chase! Come on out here, Chase. Uh, yes, sir. How you think you did? I think I did well. Think you did well? Yeah. You? I think I did pretty well. Yeah. Yes, sir. I mean, like, well, well, or just well? Well, well. 
Well, well. Very well. Well, well. Well, well done. Well, very well done. Philippine well. Philippine well. Hey. All right. All, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let me reveal the correct answers. Here we go. Uh, true or false? Alonzo Mourning returned to play after having a kidney transplant. The answer is true. Clyde Drexler was a member of the Dream Team or NBA Coach of the Year. The correct answer, the Dream Team. Who was widely considered the first player to reflect the hip-hop generation? The correct answer, Allen Iverson. True or false, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar played with both Los Angeles Lakers and Atlanta Hawks. The correct answer is false. He only played with, he played with the Los Angeles Lakers as well as the Milwaukee Bucks. Was Paul George or Willis Reed? known for the injury walkout in the 1970 NBA Finals. The correct answer, Willis Reed. What 1973 New York Knicks champion was nicknamed the Pearl? The correct answer, Earl the Pearl Monroe. He is one of the highest paid coaches currently with the Los Angeles Clippers. The correct answer is Doc Rivers. All right, Chase, you got six out of seven. Six out of seven. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> not bad. All right. That gives you a score of 750 points. 750 points. My girl, Tiara, you got five. Five out of seven. That's still not bad. Five out of seven. That brings your score to 550 points. 550. But guess what? Coming up next, we're going to bring y'all coaches into the game. Okay. Y'all ready for that? Ready. Yes, sir. Are you comfortable with your coach? I love my coach. You love your coach? She, she better be ready. Okay. You, you, you need to talk to her. Then. Your coach? Oh, he's, he's been ready. You sure? <laughs> hey, he better be. Okay. <laughs> All right, when we come back, we're going to be playing what we call the name play round. The name play round right after this. This is BCQ. State Farm's presentation of the Black College Quiz will return after these messages. After college, I love to study at LSU and study Southern literature. I like to be an English professor and one day get my doctors of English. Uh, one unique thing about me is that I love to travel. I travel at least three times a year. Um, it's something I like the world to know. I didn't chose Philander. Philander chose me. And although it's no big name like Hampton or Howard Spelman, I'm going to be able to make the school so that one day when I say I'll go to Philander, you know exactly what school I'm talking about. Welcome back. It's time for the name play round, a round where the students get a little help from their coaches. We're going to bring them out right now. Coaches! <laughs> on out here. Young man. How are you, sister? All right, have a seat there. All right, you are coach. Give me your name. What's your name, darling? Shannon Johnson. Shannon Johnson. All right, welcome, welcome. You ready today? I'm ready. You sure? I'm, I'm really All ready. All right, she got confidence in you. You know this? I'm ready, ready. All right. Now, tell me exactly what do you do at the school? I'm a professor of English, and I'm also the director of our honors academy. Oh, okay. And she's working on her honors? She is an honor student. All right, mm -hmm. all right. Now, how many students at the school? We have about uh, 500, almost six. Five hundred. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to know all them. You know all well, them? Oh, yeah, I should. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. Okay. Give or take a few. Yeah, just a few. All right, let's see what the competition looks like. Coach? Uh... Joseph Dow. Joseph Dow. Yes, sir. All right, welcome, welcome. Pray of you, huh? Of course. All right, where are you from originally? Colleen, Texas. Colleen. Yes, sir. Go ahead, boy. Yes, That's sir. where the troops at. It is. Yes, sir. All right. <laughs> well, now, what do you what do you teach um, at Prairie View? Uh, currently, I'm an electrical engineering grad student, and I uh, operate a circus lab. Circus lab. Yes, sir. Sir, a circus, a circuit. Circuit, like okay. electrical yes, circuit. I know you <laughs> <just> <laughs> say it. <laughs> the animals you working with? I didn't right. know. Right. All right. Your, your student got confidence in you, man. I hope so. All right. You think you ready? As ready for as these I beautiful love. ladies. As ready as I ever be. All right. All right. All right, in the break, the Philander, you guys won the toss. You decided to go last, right? Yes, sir. All right, so we're going to put the fellas on deck. PB, you, you know. Uh-uh, there they go. <laughs> All right, let's go. Hit your spot, baby. Let's get it cracking up here. <laughs> Prayer View is on deck. You got 60 seconds, 60 seconds. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The category is Anthony Mackey. Anthony Mackey is the category. Team Prayer View, are you ready? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, you got 60 seconds. Ready? Start the clock. Uh, what's his profession? Uh, actor. Mm. Uh, his, uh, the person he worked with as Falcon? Uh, Captain America. Ooh. Um, the person he played on Notorious? Uh, Jimmy. Uh, oh. uh, 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 the, like, Notorious is, uh, enemy portrayed in the movie. B.I.G.? No, the, his enemy. His enemy? Yes, the uh, the guy he did, uh, uh, the person, they, they weren't friends. Pass, pass, pass. Uh, where he's from? Uh, New Orleans. Yeah. 
Uh, the movie deal with Eminem. Uh, a mile. Uh, the school he graduated from. Uh, UNC. Pass, pass. Uh, the movie he did with uh, Hillary Shank, Swank. Uh, pass. Uh, uh, the movie where he was a, a bomb diffuser. Uh, her locker. Uh, um, uh, hit him up, uh, California Love. Uh, Oh, Tupac. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. Right, uh, this is a Time's school. up. Time's up. <laughs> good job, good job. Come on, ladies, keep moving. Come on. Good job. Oh, you was killing me with Tupac. <laughs> it was in my. Could not get it out your system. All right, ladies, you ready? Yes, ready. All right, it is time for for Linder. All right, check it out. The category is Taraji P Henson. Right. Taraji P. Henson. You already know how it's done. You got 60 seconds. Are you ready? Ready. Start the clock. Uh, J uh, Jody. Baby boy. Um, Idris Elba. Uh, 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 bad. Uh, opposite of yes. Good. Opposite of yes. Bad, no. Okay, pass. Uh, Jaden Smith. Uh, Cardi Kid. Um, the Curious Case of... Benjamin Button? Yes. It's hard out here for... Uh, hustle and Flow. Um, she plays Cookie. Uh, Empire. Um, Steve Harvey's book. Uh, Think Like a Man. Uh, opposite of... Okay. Opposite of no... Oh. Yeah, that's it. Sorry. <laughs> Are we still in time? No good deed? Uh, yes, it was. <laughs> All right. We'll see what happens. We'll see if we get y'all that way. Come on over here and have a seat. Good job. Not bad. You want to just go on and tell it to her, huh? Oh, uh, you know. You said, no, the opposite of yes. I got a little confused. She said, is it opposite of yes? You said good. I was like, no. It's not the opposite. How'd you feel up there? Uh, <laughs> nervous. A little different, ain't it? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. yes, sir. What do you think about your coach now? Oh, he did good. I did, did all right? Did all right? Yeah. He did all right. Yeah, all right, when he get back to that circus lab, you know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> it's going to be a little different out here. But we're going to see how you guys did. I, I think you guys did very well. I'm trying to remember the ones that you all, you missed which one? Uh, Juilliard was a school that he attended. Yeah. Um, what was the other one? Tupac took us a while. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> when you got to the how do you want it, though, that, <laughs> that pretty much rang the bell. Right. Good job. Prayer of you. All right, you got six. Six correct answers, bringing your score up to... 1,050 points. 1,050. <laughs> not bad, not bad at all. Philander Smith, you got six correct, um, and it brings your score up to 850 points. <laughs> 850. All right, you know what's up next? It is the wager round. Students can choose to bid none, some, or all of their points on our final question. Today's wager category is first acts. First act. Students, grab your tablets. All right, get ready to write down your wager, and we will reveal the question right after this break. State Farm's presentation of the Black College Quiz will return after these messages. Stay in the know with everything BCQ. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at BLK College Quiz. Then make sure you like us on Facebook at Black College Quiz. Join the conversation everywhere by using the hashtag Black College Quiz. Welcome back. The winner of this game will advance to the next round of competition, and they'll have a chance to continue to win more money and prizes. But now it's all about the wager round question. After I read it, students, you got 15 seconds to write down your answer. Here is the question. First acts is the category. The play Top Dog, Underdog is a rare example of a woman writing a drama with what feature? Start the clock. One woman show. Female characters remain off stage. Only male characters. Male characters remain off stage. The play Top Dog Underdog is a rare example of a woman writing a drama with what feature? Time is up. Put them down. The correct answer is only male characters. Only male characters. All right, let's go to Tierra first. Tierra, right now you have 850 points. What did you wager? Let me see what you wager. Oh, uh, 750 points, and you got one woo, one woo, woo. What is that? 
Uh, it's supposed to be one woman show. One woman show, which is the wrong answer, brings you down to 100 points. I am sorry, 100. Let's see what my man Chase did. We never know. Chase, let's see. You're sitting on 1,050 points. How much did you wager? 750. 750. And it's supposed to be the females remain off cast, off stage. And that is the wrong answer. I'm sorry. It brings you down to 300 points. But Chase, you win. You got 300. Yeah, got 100. Big round of applause. That means Chase is today's BCQ winner. Winning not only scholarship dollars, but advancing to the next round of competition and the chance to continue to win more money and prizes and your way to the tournament of BCQ champions. You getting close. Yes, Long way to go, but close. Yes, sir. All right, Tierra, we don't let nobody go home empty-handed, so we got some BCQ prizes and scholarship money for you as well, all right? Yeah. Give it up, give it up. Hey, I'm your boy, Nephew Tommy, for the Black College Quiz BCQ. We will see you next time. This presentation of Black College Quiz has been brought to you by State Farm. Find your agent at statefarm.com and in part by McDonald's, deeply rooted in the community 365 days a year, and Walmart, low prices every day on everything at Walmart.